What's great about coming into the Festival Hall that's been shut for three years, apart from being a, a vaccine centre, is that we're opening up to loads of different companies and people in our community that do good stuff. We're working with Tony Moran from the Denton Bowling Group. We're working with Janet Fagan, who's a theatre group. We've also got John Gilmore, who's a Lifeline Ambulance. And we've got the NHS, who now are going to come and join us at our luncheon club, which is the last Thursday of every month. And they're going to do health assessments on people, blood pressure, cholesterol, free advice on how to live your life better. Why is it important to have a defib unit? Um, early intervention when somebody's having a cardiac arrest is vital. Um, getting a defib to help um, get their heart back into a normal rhythm um, can save their life dramatically from just doing CPR. And if anyone's got a defib unit where they're based, should they be aware of how it works? Um, it's better to be aware so you can be more prepared. Um, you will get talked through via the defib, so do not worry if it's a different machine or you're somewhere else. Um, but if you've got one nearby, try and learn how to use them, definitely. So, Denise, why are you raising money for a defib unit? After our Christmas party here at the Festival Hall, where one of our uh, luncheon persons had a bit of a incident there was uh, no defibrillator here on hand to help him so what we're going to do now is we're going to raise funds for a much needed defibrillator that could be on the building and everyone can to it so the uh, fundraiser is going to go on at the indian plaza 22nd of february uh, tickets are 20 pound per person or 10 pound for a child it's a three course meal uh, you can pick tickets up from the Festival Hall or you can pick them up from uh, the Indian Plaza.